Nope. Not yet. Not yet. All right, I want to thank everybody for showing up today and uh, celebrating Sarah's accomplishments and pretty much we can call this the pinnacle of her high school career. She's going to go to the University of Kentucky and Nas and represent Springdale. Um, I want to talk about some of the things I, I joke with her. <laughs> the only thing she's got left to do is put on a cape and fly around. <laughs> and, uh, we're going to go over a few of the things that, when well, I say a few, it's a lot of them. Um, Three-time state champ, going for the fourth, homecoming queen of this year, student council president this year, uh, 4.0 GPA, uh, National Junior Honor Society, and last year she did track and was voted was it with the Sportsmanship Award? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> uh, that's a pretty long list. I would have to say that she is, to my knowledge, one of the most accomplished athletes in Springdale High School history. I don't know of uh, another team person who's won three state titles and we get that foot right, uh, be fourth title in a row. Um, a lot of that credit goes to Mr. Howard and his son. They have worked, that's the gentleman on the far left there. They have worked with her for the last six years. And a lot of her um, accomplishments is due to him and his son and their family. They've taken a lot of time out of their schedule to make her what she is today. Um, yes, yeah, so the round of they've done is hard to explain. They've just taken a lot of time and really asked for nothing in return, which is amazing. Um, the biggest supporters of her are her parents, and this is a day that I know that they're celebrating here with her. <laughs> As you can see by the collage, they have been all over this country with this young lady, supporting her, helping her. Now they have to help carry her around. <laughs> you know, even though she signed, it doesn't stop. Um, <laughs> um, this little girl, it's funny because the first time I got to see her, I knew Sarah, you hear about Sarah, everybody knows Sarah. I didn't know really Sarah until I came in one day, we were going to a meet. She was diving, you know, everybody's kind of jittery. She's, she ain't worried about it. Um, I walk in and I, I, I don't even know how to do it. And I haven't seen anybody do it in a long time. She was knitting. <laughs> I don't even know if anybody knows that about her. She was just going to town. She might have done a quilt that day. I don't even know she was just going and I just thought that was so unique. Just to let you know how down to earth and humble this little girl is. Um, I do want to thank Coach Goggin, our AD, Mr. West and Mr. Ross for showing today. Mr. Jinks has had a workshop, so he was unable to be here. All the administration principals, parents. We have a member, uh, Mr. Hutchison, of the school boards here to see this. Uh, Sarah's grandparents are here with us. Mr. Allen with the Morning News is here. Thanks to you all. I'll stop talking. We're going to let Sarah say a few words. Uh, I just want to thank you all for being here and celebrating in this day. Thank you.